Hi, boys and girls. I'm so excited to see you today as we continue our personal narratives about our birthday. Yesterday, you worked on step three of writing a personal narrative, which was drawing the picture. We did the beginning pictures, and this was a picture of me at the beach um, on my birthday. So that was the beginning of my story. And yesterday, you did your beginnings of your stories. Well, today, boys and girls, we're going to keep doing step three, drawing the pictures, but this time we have to do the middle of the story. So think about your birthday wherever you were. Think about the things that were happening. What did you do while you were there? Were you hitting a pinata? Were you having cake? Were you opening presents? Were you at the park with your friends or your family? Did you have game time or movie time with your family at home? What were you doing on your birthday? Well, that's the middle. You're going to draw pictures to show us what happened in the middle of your story. And my friend bringing me balloons while I'm laying out at the beach is one of the things that happened to me in the middle of my story on my birthday at the beach. Okay. I did another picture because the middle part of our story is the biggest part of our story. So here's another picture of me and my friend playing in the water with a ball um, at the beach. So it's still showing what's happening in the middle of my story. The next part that's going to come is drawing the pictures for the end of my story. So at the end of a story, everybody has rosy cheeks now because we got a little sunburn at the beach. But there's my friend and there's me and there's a birthday cake because we had some cake at the end of the story. And then you can see my little face in the corner with some Z's up there. That means I was really tired. My eyes are closed because it was a really tiring day, but fun at the beach. So the pictures now, I have my pictures for the beginning part of my story. I have the pictures. There were a couple pictures that showed what happened in the middle of my story, the events of my birthday, and then the ending picture. So the beginning, middle, and end. That is what you're going to need in your story. Well, now, boys and girls, it is your turn. So you're going to get your birthday book out, the same one that you started yesterday. You're going to open it up. You already have your title written down, My Birthday. You have your first page. You're going to turn to your first page, your very next page. Um, that's where your beginning of the story is. Well, now you're going to turn one more time. Page is still the same. You still have your lines at the bottom and your plain part at the top. This is your drawing part. So this is where you can use this whole part here to draw the pictures, no words yet, the pictures that show what happened in the middle of your story. What were the events that happened? And then you're going to turn the page one more time and you're going to make your last page show what happened at the end of your birthday story. So think about that. How did your birthday end? end and that's going to go on that last part so remember we're not doing any words we're going to be doing our words next time i see you but this time you're just doing the pictures for your middle of the story and for the end of your story can't wait to see what you're doing boys and girls and i will see you next time